Hello guys, this is Damian from forexbot.com and welcome back to our video examples on the live forex trading account. We remind that the trade you will see here is with and only educational purpose. So the chart is British pound, American dollar forex pair. I'm rushing to sell immediately because I got a confirmation of a chart pattern, a head and shoulders chart pattern. So this is why I immediately sold without explaining you why, but this is what I'm going to do now. So I noticed that uh, the British pound American dollar forex pair is forming something like a head and shoulders pattern. Although it looks a little bit strange, I believe it might appear to be a valid one because as you see it's kind of stretched and the shoulders are pretty sharp. But uh, still we should not disregard the pattern and uh, its potential. And I currently, I just uh, drew it on the chart for you. Um, the pattern is uh, now uh, present, marked with blue. Okay, and now I'm going to put my stop loss order in this trade so I will be protected. And uh, I will not be like blindly in the market. The stop loss order of my trade goes above the second shoulder on the chart. This way my trade is protected. So the overall potential of the head and shoulders pattern is bearish. You should remember this. The pattern has its bullish equivalent, which is called inverted head and shoulders pattern, which uh, is pretty much a mirror image at, of this pattern, pattern, but upside down. So the head and shoulders comes uh, appears during bullish trends and it uh, basically signalizes that this trend might reverse while the inverted hand and shoulders pattern comes after uh, during bearish trends and it signalizes that this trend might be reversing too. So pretty much the pattern represents price uh, slowdown or hesitation or also known as consolidation where the pair is uh, not trending but it's rather ranging. And now let me uh, show you a few more stuff about this pattern. So the, uh, the, the two bottoms that are located in the base of the head over here and over here, when connected with a single line, this line is called the neckline of the head and shoulders pattern. And the confirmation of the pattern comes with the breakout through the neckline. In our case, the breakout came right when I started the video, which is the reason why I rushed in rushed in selling the cable the british pound american dollar forex pair and now i'm marking the breakout with this circle over here okay and when the price confirms the head and shoulders pattern uh, this uh, indicates that the price is likely to reverse maybe or to seek a retracement lower and the expected distance uh, in bearish direction equals to the vertical size between the tip of the head and the neckline which is like, like over here and now i measure this distance with the green rectangle you see and now i'm going to apply it starting from the moment of the breakout so my target uh i'm sorry i need to measure it again because i i messed it up a bit S here it is so my target in this trade is located at the bottom of this green rectangle. For this reason, I'm going to position a take profit order over there. Uh, somewhere at 1.2985. All right. Uh, the trade is ready to go, and now I'm going to mark uh, my entry point, my stop loss order, and my target. In this trade so i'll have them visualized in case the price hits one of these levels and close the trade so we will have what to talk uh, about stop loss order goes with red somewhere at 1.3040 and take profit order i'm gonna mark with green color over here uh at 1.2985 approximately okay so i enter at 1.3013 and my target is at 1.2915 which is uh 29.85 i apologize which is approximately 28 pips uh target in this trade pretty decent target 
which is uh, maybe about uh, maybe 0.3 percent not sure but we're going to do the calculations at the end of this video uh, to see what happened with the trade okay see that the price is fighting uh, the bears are fighting for dominance we see slight hesitation here because after uh, one, two, three, four, five, six consecutive bearish candles. The price of finally closed one bullish candle, which is very tiny and it resembles a dodgy, but it is not a dodgy. But anyway, the the open level and the close level are extremely close to each other, meaning that there will probably be uh, some kind of a retracement, maybe or return above my entry point. Uh, which is uh, not that of a big deal since my target is still over there and I expect that the the price will hit it But anyway now I'm going to pause this video and I'll come back to you later uh, with the results uh, from this trade Okay guys, I am uh, back uh, A little bit later maybe like uh, let me measure what time I'm back like 30 and now it's like seven five hours later yeah i'm back to show you that the price action has hit my take profit order something like maybe uh 10 20 about 30 minutes ago the price action hit my take profit order and made this trade uh, totally successful however uh, the decrease continued even further, but the the breakout through my take profit order was very sharp, and I was unable like to take any actions at all. So this is all I can do in this trade. The most important thing is that the trade is fully and 100% successful, um, meaning that uh, the head and shoulders pattern on the British pound American dollar forex pair was traded successfully. Notice that I entered somewhere over here. The price was generally decreasing, and the decrease could be measured with this bearish trend line over here, which means that the the price drop was uh, relatively consistent. However, the price suddenly shot down in bearish direction, and it hit my take profit order. So now let's do some calculations and to see how this trade performed in terms of uh, percentage results and success rate not success rate but percentage profits is what, what i meant so i entered at 1.3013 and 1.3013 and uh, my take profit order was at 1.2985 uh, 1.2985 which is a 28 pips target, which equals to 0 0.0028 from the current exchange rate of the British pound American dollar forex pair. And when I divide this number by the entry price at 1.3013, I get a result of 0 0.00215169.4. And multiplying this number, number by 100 will give me my percentage profit from this trade, which is 0 0.20. 2% approximately a uh, pretty good trade uh, it took uh, slightly more time than I expected but the most important thing is that the trade is successful and that the profit uh, is created so nothing wrong in this 0.22% which is 28 pips profit from the trade uh, and notice that this yellow trend line was tested one, two, three, four, five, six times, and on the sixth bounce from the trend, the price created a slight, uh, relatively sharp decrease over here, and then after a slight consolidation, it simply like shot down in bearish direction, making my trade absolutely successful. So that's a pretty good thing, but why was this bounce so sharp? Uh, maybe the 
maybe the result of the decrease it looks like it's on like an economic event maybe uh, hmm. there was an announcement of the philadelphia fed manufacturing index for may uh, which was announced at 38.8 on a forecast for 19.5 and maybe this is the reason for the sharp decrease the announcement was uh, like uh, Hmm, in what time? Nope, the announcement was relatively earlier, so probably the the result, yeah. Probably the the decrease came as a result of the speech of uh, Mario Draghi, who is uh, the the president of the European Central Bank. Who I believe started his speech uh, maybe um, maybe an hour and fifteen minutes ago, which kind of responds to the to the event on the chart. Yeah, totally, totally. Yeah, this is the the reason for the sharp price decrease. Anyway, the important thing is that the trade is fully successful. And uh, the profit equals to 0 0.22 percent for. Um, can I see, please? For like about five hours, yeah, which is a pretty good result. 28 pips, 0 0.22 percent for about five hours. So thank you very much for watching. This was Damian from ForexVote.com. Looking forward to see you on the next live forex trading session and until then I wish you happy and safe forex trading.